Oh, it's been a while since we made a pizza. Hello, everyone, and welcome to Sunday. Um, we, well, when I say make a pizza, what I mean is open the box that comes from the Costco and take out the frozen pizza and put it in. But still, it has been a while since we did that, so I guess it still counts. And I do believe that this is that. Yeah, that's looking good. That's looking good. I like to I like to put it on broil for the last like few seconds. I cannot do this with one hand. Hold on. Oh yeah, there we go. Ooh, it's looking good. Oh, that's looking real good. Oh yeah, I'm gonna let that sit for just a minute. Um, so today, and, and I say today, but really it's been like the past few days. I've been working on a video um, that I'm getting ready to release uh, tonight, maybe tomorrow, probably tomorrow at this point, but um, I finally filmed it today and it is a explanation about What's been going on with Stephen Plays? Um, because we've actually been going through a lot of like little changes and things over the past few months, and patrons have known what's been going on because we've been discussing that on the the Patreon videos and talking to them, but we haven't brought it to the public yet, and that's what this video is designed to do. Because there's been enough changes that it's you know it, it can be a little alarming. To folks that don't know what's going on, and I, it's not—it's not that I ever wanted to like keep that from people. I've just been sidetracked because I've been busy with so many things. So there's been enough change at this point that like making a proper video for it makes sense. So I did it, and it came out longer than I wanted it to come out, but I had a lot to cover, and I think it'll be really interesting for folks because it covers not only like the changes that we're doing, but also kind of like how YouTube works behind the scenes. Um, and the way that YouTube works in 2022, I mean, it probably makes sense for YouTube, but it's a very, it causes problems with very specific channels. Steven Plays is one of them. Um, so yeah, I'm going to be getting that out soon. And that's what I spent today working on. And um, I'm excited for folks to, to see it. And really for folks to better understand where we're coming from with some of the changes and stuff that we've been doing. And uh, kind of like, what our thought process is as we try something. Because if you know the circumstances in which we're operating, it'll m make it a lot easier to understand why we try this, that, or the other. So hopefully that'll help explain some things to folks. And uh, by the time you get this vlog, that video is out. So hopefully you enjoyed it. And if you haven't seen it, it's over on Steven Plays. So you can go check it out. Oh my God, I'm so ready. I'm so ready. Let me, let me cut it, hold on. Don't you know, don't you know, don't you know, it's pizza time. Pizza time. Pizza time. Pizza time and more super as we uh, continue to work further into um, the uh, tournament of power. So far, been really good. Don't wanna to say too much about it because we'll be talking more about it when we do a review, but I like it. I use this opportunity also to say a shout out to our Patreon producers. It is somehow May 1st and uh, April flew by, but April was also really busy because after a long time of not going anywhere and having guests, mm -hmm. I mean, the last time that we had been somewhere was December when we went to Florida. Yeah. So And before that was surgery. Yeah, so like and I don't know the last time we had guests. That's been a while. That was like extra life maybe. Yeah, extra life. And I can't remember the last time we did both in one month. So April was April was busy, you know, like between um visiting uh Birmingham and seeing Alex and Haley again and then having uh Mark and Rhonda here. That was a lot, and uh, Mal, I, I, I want to tell you specifically, I'm really proud of you because you lost probably you know a week or so worth of work time between mm -hmm. 
going places and having folks here, and you still got your work done. So good job. Uh, Mal, Mal wrapped up her painting tonight, and that means I can just straight up tell you what it is. Um, it is Kirby in the Forgotten Land, and it's really good. I'm I'm so impressed with it, especially because I struggled in college just to get like one point perspective down, and Mal's doing three point perspective paintings. I remember you doing one point perspective. Do in you college. remember? Mm -hmm. Yeah, there's a particularly like embarrassingly bad one point perspective drawing you did. Yeah. 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 You do better now. I would do better now. I think yeah, I would, would. I would better understand the. I'd be a the, teacher. I, I, I would like it if you were my teacher. I would learn so much from you, and also I could bug you anytime I didn't quite understand. <laughs> anyway, while I was struggling with one point perspective in college, Mal now is doing three point perspective paintings, and it's just really cool looking. And it's nice because these sorts of pieces are some of my favorite where like they obviously are the game that they're trying to showcase but also they're just really cool pieces on their own and um you know i don't know who's going to win this piece but uh it wouldn't matter if they had played kirby in the forgotten land or not like they may just really appreciate the look of yeah. the painting and it would look really good you know hanging in a house so yeah also, you could probably tell someone that it was The Last of Us, <laughs> and it could probably somewhat pass for that. Mm -hmm. Kirby, Kirby in the Forgotten Land, that first area, mm -hmm. has got big Last of Us vibes. Mm -hmm. um, when they showed the trailer with the car like a long time ago, that's my first I was like, that yeah, looks like The Last of Us. Anyway, um, yeah, so that's out. Go, go check that out. And uh, again, if you get a chance, you can watch the video I put on Steven Plays. It is long, I won't lie to you, but um, I think that you would find it interesting. Maybe you can have it on in the background or something. But uh, it gives a, a better heads up about what's going on. And, um, you know, uh, if you're interested in learning about stuff uh, slightly ahead of time, there's also Patreon. Because um, I know we showed the ticker, but we appreciate all of our patrons and... Uh, we appreciate having discussions with them as well, uh, trying to figure out, because we've been working not only with the partner manager at YouTube to figure out stuff for the channel, but we've also been uh, you know, getting ideas from patrons and uh, trying to formulate some sort of, of plan for the channel in the future. And uh, we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. Regardless, we're still having a lot of fun on Twitch and not anything's really going to change there and not anything's really going to change here. We're just looking at Steven plays for altering things um, to to have a path forward. But um, everything else is we like what we do. So it's probably going to it's probably going to stay relatively the same. All right. I got to eat this pizza. Thank you so much for watching. And as always, let's meet back tomorrow, shall we?